I am joined by Kayode Idou, spokesperson of the Independent National Electoral Commission, or INEC. He joins us via telephone link up from the Nigerian capital, Abuja. Good evening, Mr. Idou. Good evening, Chaka. How are you? I am hugely terrific. Uh, how is Abuja? Abuja is fine. And how is Washington? Washington is equally terrific. Now, I was talking with some people, of course, and uh, they are concerned about uh, the postponement of the election. Why did you postpone the election when the Council of State, which is a very, very, very powerful body in your country, gave you the green light to go ahead? And it met last week on Thursday. Thank you, Chaka, for that question. But let me correct the impression. The Council of State did not give IMF the green light to go ahead. By law, the decision is IMF, and I need to underscore that because the Commission is an independent commission. The law provides for the Commission to take that decision, and we should be assured. But even this is credible is the decision of the commission. Now, why did the commission decide to schedule them? The commission is, even though it is independent, it is also realistic. It has to look at the reality of something and be guided by this reality. And if the reality are such that the environment is not conducive, so going ahead with the election on the on February 28th and, and February 14th and February 28th, then the sensible thing to do is to schedule. And that's what the commission has done. Well, unfortunately, time happens not to be our best ally, Mr. Kayode Idowu, the spokesperson or professor at Ahir Jega, the chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission or INEC. He joined us via telephone link up from Abuja.